Good morning, Deify here, and welcome back to Kitty Powers Matchmaker, our quest for 25 kids. We're going to start off with mail, as we normally do. Uh, Leo, oh, good, we got mail from Bone Quisha, but Leo Dickenbush, oh, Cole's giving me the heave-ho, we're going to stay friends, though, eh? Really like him and all, especially his never-ending talk about building flat-pack furniture and his unusual passion for gossiping didn't bother me neither. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, well, we're gonna lose some of that reputation right there. Bonquisha, what you got? Oh. Ended the relationship with Rose because she was a fail in every department. Rose and I shared some common ground, for example, her interest in share prices, but her strange insistence on Harajuku style was the major reason for failure. And you lied the majority of the time. Okay, yeah, that's my bad. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And they're not letting me take it easy today. We're gonna start with the easiest person, Oliver, a three-star dentist looking for a woman. His interests include watching soap operas, collecting antiques, and rearranging the furniture. Now is that just rearranging it, or is that like feng shui? Because feng shui I can understand rearranging the furniture maybe not so good, unless you're like a practical type. You love blue eyes and blonde hair, you're relaxed, methodical, extrovert, traditional, and romantic, and your bad habit is bragging, your guilty pleasure is motivational seminars. Ah, a bit of a vintage type. Okay, I guess that's where the antiques come in. And even though they don't seem like perfect matches, I'm gonna try matching Olivier, I'm sorry, it's not Oliver, Olivier Sidebottom with Mabel Tuckworth, because uh, there's a chance to get that perfect attraction if we dye his hair. Is that light brown or ginger? Light brown, so let's do that. And we changed his bangs a little bit. They went from being straight down to swooping outward to make it so that... Uh, Practical people would like it as well, because uh, she seems very practical. Yeah, pleasure to meet you. Oh, well, yeah, this place looks all right. She's a VIP. It's so difficult. Okay, and uh, there are all these compliments flying around. Good job. Whoa, okay. Wow, that's a... What do you call that hairstyle? I don't know. Uh, well, just, It's the flat top one. He looks like a pencil eraser. and Yeah, we'll take our order. Something cold with fish, darn it, didn't get uh, the new recipes that I need. Two platters of koi blah, if you'd be so kind. A wonderful choice. Does sound lovely, doesn't it? Why don't you guys talk about your job since you both make a fair amount of money? Uh, you're a brain surgeon. Ah, uh, they must earn a fortune, and how very splendid. And uh, we're a dentist, which is like the same thing, right? It's brain surgery for the mouth, you ungrateful... Ugh. Okay, well, whatever. When buying a bed, do you consider how well you will sleep or how strong the bed springs are? Oh, you're one of those people. You know what? Just tell her. I'm gonna try, like, not lying so much. It'll mean more strikes, maybe more bad dates, but, uh... Uh, it might be better in the long run. Good evening, my name is Dexter and I am the manager of this eatery. Kitty mentioned you'd be visiting us. Ah, this must be the lovely Mabel. Mabel the Barrel. Yeah, if there's anything else you require, just ask. Oh, that was well nice of him to come see us, weren't it? Yeah, very much so. I mean, talk about hairstyles then, because we didn't get much other choice. Uh, yeah, yeah, your hairstyle looks great. Uh, how do you think of hers? Oh, it's absolutely delightful. That's so good. Okay, and uh, Pencil Eraser here brings us, ooh, chocolate. I'm always good for chocolate. You think chocolate supremes are disgusting, and you love Turkish delight. Well, what about this one? Well, uh, it's not anywhere near there. So what about that one? Yep, there's one there. Uh, oh, don't like chocolate supreme. I'm sorry. How about that one? Eh, eh, all right, that's fine. That's fine. Two of them were well nice, eh? Cheers for that. Yeah, I tried. The top one would have been her favorite, my bad. And, uh, you think they're breathtakingly stunning? I'm not sure she feels the same way, just, uh, try, try uh, another date. Another date will be good. And we overdid him in practicalness because I accidentally came to tie me up again. Lost track of the envelopes, probably should have cheated. Aw, oh, she's gonna hate it. Yeah, we're here time and time. Why are we eating here Because Thai food's delicious! Okay, well, at least we get some money for it. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, wavy black hair. Or swoopy black hair. Uh, what would you like? Cold with white meat. And we didn't even get uh, another another recipe. Two platters of Yungai. 
Please, yes, it is lovely. I'm so sorry we took you here. I'm so sorry we took you here. When choosing what to read, do you prefer factual-based books or a fictional novel? Yeah, factual-based books. Nice, nice. Okay, you guys are doing pretty well now. Doing pretty well. We can save this. When in a quandary, would you rather trust your own instincts or ask other people's opinions and you to ask other people's opinions? So you look at how perfect you guys are together, except for spiciness. Don't worry about spiciness. <gasps> oh, hello. Crikey, it's the ex. I wonder who this is. That's okay. We know you're spicy, so we can tell you. You will know who this is. That would be my ex. I haven't seen them for some considerable time. You're still friendly then. It's nice, isn't it? When choosing a car, would you rather have a classic car or have the latest model? And you'd, uh, ooh, you'd rather, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'd rather have a classic car. I'm not a dinosaur, I'm just, just my own person. Oh yeah, I got my mobile. Oh, you want to take a selfie? Sure, let's do that. You just gotta smile, smile, no, no, smile, smile, no, pouting. There we go, that's a nice photo. Yeah, nice photo, the game agrees. Yeah, blimey, came out all right, didn't it? Send it to us, will you? Yeah, okay. Yeah, let's let's get out of here. Okay, we didn't find out guilty pleasure or bad habits. So we're gonna try one more date. Yeah, you're undecided now because of two strikes. It just wouldn't be. Re you're so. Uh, 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 I'm sorry. Okay, there's no one who matches him at all in the black book, so I'm just gonna set him up with Faith Ballherd. We don't know anything about her. She seems to be pretty glam though. But they like each other's eyes. We can give him pink hair and. uh they line up horoscopically and she's easy to win over, so we just need a good first date and I'm gonna get rid of this guy. And now here we are at the Jerk King, hoping to make a good impression. The pink hair looks so good with that beard. Good evening, would you happen to be Faith? Correct, I must therefore suggest you must be Oliver, yes. Oh, aren't we really good? Yeah, I meant to take you somewhere better, but I can't keep control of the envelopes, so I'm sorry. Ah, but compliments abound, good stuff, and brown pompadour here wouldn't. Okay, let's, uh, let's, uh, hot, no meat dish, nothing spicy. Uh, that sounds, no, uh, uh, spicy, no, that's spicy, spicy beef stew. I guess it's gonna be the ca the Kailu soup. Let's, uh, let's do that, please, hot, no meat, not spicy! It's great! When watching TV, do you prefer to watch a nice period drama or a saucy soap opera? Oh, nice period drama, really? That's so good. Romance levels at a maximum. I thought I, I regretted it once I clicked it. I thought she was going to be spicy. Oh, uh, what do you think of horoscopes? Oh, they're not completely without merit. Okay, just this once. I know I said I'm not going to lie as much, but this is for a good cause. This is to get you out of my agency because I can't help you. And I'm glad you hit the one that stands on its own. I think they're wonderful. Nice that we agree. I'm a Pisces. I'm a Cancer. They're completely in tune. See, now you got some hearts too. Yeah, okay. Go, go, go make a phone call. Go, go, go. Oh! Oh no! We'll never find her now. It's not like she's this one. Huh, too easy. I should get that game wrong sometime. There's an achievement for that. Ah, oh, the electricity's been restored. Yeah, we found you. We're so good. When in a relationship, do you like to know where they are or let them roam as they please? You, oh, really? You like to know where they are? Never would have guessed. Never would have guessed. Okay. Yeah, we can, we can request you a taxi. Waiter, give us a nice, easy taxi number to remember. 197-882. Yep, we'll just throw that in there. Call the taxi. Yep. Get us out of here! We need a ride! Okay. Yeah, we are very helpful. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna get you out. You only had to lie once. That's not too bad. Yeah, you think they're breathtakingly stunning? I do too. Get out of my office. Yeah, yeah. Won their cardiovascular organ. I'm the best matchmaker ever. Okay, let's try it. VIP Chris the er Chris Cole Cole Redgarden, the art house film director, looking for a woman. He likes uh, pet cats, business news, and Harajuku style, and he loves green eyes and black hair. He's relaxed, carefree, expert, experimental, and spicy. He's he's often smelly, and he likes limousines. Oh, oh no, limousines! What are we gonna do with you? Okay, again, this is a case of no one. You don't like anyone in the black book, but Ebony Hamthwaite, who appeared once before, seems all right. Uh, charity shops make me think that she's kind of a hipster. Maybe, maybe vintage. 
But, um, you know, she's easy to win over in case I want to get rid of him. They don't line up on uh, the uh, organization, and but uh, limousines and drag queens seem about the same so I, I'm gonna I'm gonna try it out with uh, Ebony and I didn't change anything about him because well I forgot I'm still kinda tired and uh, I probably could have changed his hair color but uh, I didn't uh, this place looks a bit swanky yeah it does your hair's a nice shade of black oh and your hair's black too eh oh, okay never mind they liked it so I didn't need to change anything good for me okay woo Curly fro McLong hair. Okay. Yep. What do you, what would you like? Hot with white meat. I'll take that. You know, grilled chicken and spicy sauce sounds really good. Two portions of Merg Tikka Masala, please. Inspired choice. Yes. Let's just, let's find out. I heard that you're interested in charity shops. Is that, is that cool? You like charity shops, right? Yeah, that sounds really exciting. It's all good. Uh, we like, I don't know which one of these is hipster. Uh, Harajuku style. Ah, oh, yeah, that sounds wicked. I don't even know what that is, but whatever, it worked. We got nothing to talk about. Do you like my hairstyle? Yeah, it looks alright, doesn't it? Thanks. And, uh, your hair? It's, it's not a big thing to lie about. Maybe there's, like, degrees of lying of where it's good or bad. And this one, it's just hair. It can't, it's like, whatever you know like fantastic i love it yeah I'm just gonna pop into the bog gotta check myself before i wreck myself oh yeah yeah okay silver earrings pink top brown black swoopy hair and glasses okay come back come back so i can see oh you changed your makeup didn't you yeah you, you changed your makeup you didn't have any on before there we go too good at this I think you look great, actually. That's nice of you to say. When watching TV, do you prefer to watch alone or watch with friends? And you'd like to, you'd like to watch alone. I'm, I'm sorry. I'd like to watch with friends. Bit of a live wire, isn't you? Yeah, I, I asked for that, I suppose. How much should we tip? Let's give him eight percent. Oh man, you really got to do that to me. Okay, two ninety one. Two ninety one divided by five. Let's see if I can actually do this this time. Five to twenty five or fifty to. 25, 50, and 8, so minus 58, 291, minus 58, 233, that should do it, yeah, we're a bit brainy, yeah, they want to close the restaurant, maybe we should go then, um, you could, yeah, you, you're you not just going to take her that easily, yeah, you had a terrific time, great, great, we'll see you again next time. I mean, who cares if now you don't match up on two of the three personality traits, you can still match up. On three, and I meant to say two of the five, but you can still match up on three, so it's it's all good. Yeah, we're bringing you a nice restaurant. Whoa, too much makeup, lady. Uh, yeah, what would you like? With a bowl cut? Really? Okay, cold with white meat. Well, chicken. Chicken salad sounds good. Two portions of Hunderslai, please. Oh, yeah. It's so lovely. Do you have any guilty pleasures? We know you like drag queens. Uh, drag queens should be good, right? Oh, well, okay, that's, that's nothing really to feel guilty about. And our guilty pleasure, limousines. You, How do you not like... How are drag queens and limousines not both glam? They both seem glam to me. If you're going out for the evening, would you rather go bowling or go to the movies? And you'd like to go go bowling. I'd rather go to the movies! Oh, you guys just can't do it. You know what? I don't even care that your belly's rumbling. Lower than a jack. Okay. We're good. We're good. Higher than a six. Okay. 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 Lower than a queen. Jeez, oh, ten's going to be hard. I'm going to go lower. I'm going to go lower. It's going to be higher. Hey, aces are wild. Nice. Uh, yeah, we're just so happy to be here. I'm glad to hear it. Yeah. Happy. When keeping in touch with friends, would you just call them on the phone or message them on social media? Oh, good. You guys line up on something. Something. Yeah, we can call you a taxi. Get us out of here ASAP. 823-8022. 8022. Okay, call it as fast as possible. I don't think these two are going to be together. Uh-huh. Yeah, nice one. Cheers for that. Okay, time to go home. Yeah. Maybe I'll give them one more chance if he'll allow it, but... Oh, cat. Oh, got it. Oh, yeah, he's not that keen. Okay, let's let's just be friends. Sorry. Okay, this one might be better. Lena Goodbridge. They don't really have any attraction, but they line up horoscopically, and she seems 
like she is uh, at least partially hipster with the retro pinups. So, do we know anything about her? No, we don't know anything about her. I'm gonna try this. Really, girl? Overalls over that top? Alright. And Miu's Lotus Garden, here we come. Pretty hungry as it goes, yep. Okay, hey, are you Lena? I, I would therefore suggest your coal. Nice, yeah, good timekeeping. With restaurants, it's a new culinary standard, and your follicle coloration is pleasing. Yeah, we dyed it just for you. Okay, we have another bowl cut, lady. Okay, what would you like? A cold, no-meat dish, and nothing fried. Cold, no-meat, nothing fried. Deep-fried vegetables, yeah. No, cold, no-meat, nothing fried. Hiyashi chuka. There we go. Two portions of hiyashi chuka, please. A very wise choice, yes. When you go to a talk or lesson, do you sit at the back or sit at the front? And you, uh, sit at the front! There! We're off to a good start! Sociability is the only viable option, isn't it? Isn't it? You have to dig a big hole. Would you rather get a spade and start digging, or pay someone else to do it? You'd get a spade and start digging. I'm sorry, I myself would pay someone else. Jeez, oh, why is this just like always terrible? Okay. Story from our life. We used to go to the seaside on our holidays, and then a bird attacked me. I used to take music lessons, and then I got hit by a car. I'm gonna cheat a little bit. Uh, my very first car was a real old banger. It turned out to be a rare classic, and I sold it for loads of money! Holla! Oh, so good. Oh, yeah. Highest level of engrossment. Yeah, you know it. We're good at storytelling. Oh, free money. Always nice. When making flat pack furniture, do you read the instructions first or make it up as you go along? And you make it up as you go along. There you go. You're off. You guys are off to a good start. Chaos can be a good thing. Yeah, of course. Taxi will arrive soon. Do you have your smartphone available? Sure. Are you able to take a selfie of us? Uh, yeah. You got a smile though. Okay, girl. Oh, fantastic. You guys are making it so easy on me. That's only a nice photo. Come on. That's fantastic right there. Yeah, we can send it to you wirelessly. Yeah, let's leave. Let's leave. Um, how do, how do you feel about her? You could, you could take them or leave them. Okay, so I guess with VIPs, you're not allowed to get any strikes. Maybe that's my problem. So maybe you should lie a little bit with VIPs. Watch out, El Toro Picante. Here we come. Okay, it's date number two with these two. So, hello, Lena. Nice to see you again. Yeah. Okay, we can do this. Very impressed with your knowledge of local fooderies. Yeah, we try, we try, okay. Wow, she has pompadours on like three parts of her hair. That's amazing. Would you like to order? Cold no meat dish and uh no tomatoes. Cold no meat and no tomatoes. Uh that's that's warm. Uh that's chicken. Cold no meat, no tomatoes. Uh two portions of ajo blanco, please. Inspired choice. It is deliciously edible. Do you have any guilty pleasures? Ah, oh, you're secretly excited by tanks? Just tell her you love it, they're tanks! Oh, you're gonna mess that up real bad. Okay, she should be really easy to lie to. Don't make me regret this. Please do not make me regret this, because if you make me regret this, I'm just I'm going to cry and things will not be very happy, and I think you did it, so we're okay. We're good. We're good. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff. Yeah, tanks? Tanks are awesome! <laughs> That's awesome! You shouldn't hide it, yeah. And our guilty pleasure, we like limousines. I should have said ham radio. <laughs> oh, okay, well, let's make you like her a little bit more, okay? Shall we? Because I want to get you out of my office as well. No one lines up with him. Do you have any bad habits? Oh, uh, you have an irrational compulsion for sleeping all day. I actually like that. Oh, yeah, there you go. And, uh, we are dreadful of being smelly. I have no issue with that at all. Oh, what a relief. Oh, that's so nice. You attended an indie concert recently, and it was particularly exciting. Affirmative, and my image was on the vast high-definition display. The image is on my telecommunication device. Okay. The overalls over that red dress and the yellow glasses and the money. We can do this. There you are, sitting way in back. Sitting way in back. I thought you liked sitting in front. Uh, I heard that you're interested in retro pinups. Oh, yeah. Retro pinups are... Yeah, that sounds nice. It pleases me the way you think. And uh, 
We like Harajuku style. Oh, that sounds hyper optimal. Oh, you know it. It would be expedient to reimburse the establishment. I'll call our waiter. Where's Tripomp? That's what I'm just going to call her. Holly, Tripomp, get over here. Yeah, yeah, very good. Do excuse me. Here's your bill. This actually went really well after that uh, first iffy part, but hey, whatever. He, like, he didn't like tanks, but yeah, you quite like them. She quite likes you too. Yeah, you want to get more serious? Yes. So good. Rid of a VIP. And we'll try one more VIP because apparently I'm very mean to myself. This is Adriana Weinberg. She's an angel investor looking for a man. She's into dark comedy, army surplus shops, and playing the theremin. So I'm spying some edgy and geeky in there. Loves brown eyes and purple hair. Act the methodical expert. Experimental and spicy. Your bad habit is being noisy and your guilty pleasure is playing chess. Uh, yeah, classic edgy type. Is playing the theremin edgy? Because I thought that was geeky, but apparently your guilty pleasure is geeky. Let's see what we got. I know I say it so many times, but I'm gonna do it once more. Jackson Uphauser may be the one for her. They line up on these three personality traits, you know, they're not horoscopically good but whatever we just need to give her black hair so there's mutual attraction let's try that let's do it and mario's mansion is just about to see the most perfect date that well jackson could ever go on hi are you jackson yeah you must be adriana right so fab to meet you. you're totally on time shady keep anyone waiting around yeah i'm living for your purple hair and your black hair is so current uh-huh okay so we have light brown facial hair ponytail it's on your food radar. Cold with no meat would be fabuloso. That's that's mushroom risotto. Okay, ravioli de monzo. Insalata caprice. Can we have a caprice salad, please? Inspired choice. It is amazing. Trust me, I'm a gourmet. Kitty Powers says so. When it comes to sports, this isn't an activity question, do you prefer solo games or team games? And you prefer team games? Team games? This is amazing! You are having a party right now, right now! There's just one more. Would you rather have a game of Snap or Spin the Bottle? Spin the... Sp st I, I don't believe it. Yes, Spin the Bottle. Please, Kitty. We just gotta get these two together. They're so good. There's no way this can mess up. Oh, an X? I don't even care. It's the X. It's just Fabaroonie, yeah. <laughs> just get out of here, okay? So, who's the weirdo? Well, that's our X. I haven't seen him in like forever. It's cool that you're still friendly. Well, we're both grown ups, so you know. How do you rate my outfit? Oh, yeah, wowzers, it's incredible. Bubbles, dress to impress. That's how I roll. And are uh, digging your outfit? OMG, yes, you've got mad fashion skills. I feel like totally legend. This is perfect. The food was to our taste. Okay, uh, no, we're actually going to give you the entire bill if we can, which apparently we cannot. Oh, geez, they're all going the wrong way. Go into Jackson's. There we go. Into Jackson's, please. I want him to pay. Eh, whatever. Dutch is fine. I don't even care. Let's split it 50-50. I, I don't think I've, like, ever gotten that game to go one way or the other. Oh, cat. Got him. Yeah, you think they're absolutely gorgeous? I do, too. Go out with them. Right now. This is so good. Jackson. Th I think this is, like, the third time or something, but she may be the one. Hold on to her, buddy. And I think we have time for one more easy one. Here's Duncan, a two-star movie critic. Looking for a woman. His interests include entrepreneurism, business meetings, and budgeting. Are you chic? You love green eyes and black hair. Active, methodical, introvert, traditional, and romantic. Your bad habit is rushing all the time, and one's guilty pleasure is skateboarding. That's way too edgy. And I could have sworn we had some chic types in here, but apparently not. So we're going to try and go for that achievement once more. This is Myla Highland. That's fun to say. Myla Highland! She's a hotel receptionist, easy to win over, definite hippie type, she likes pet hamsters, countryside walks, and growing flowers, and uh, we don't know anything about her, so this might be pretty good. Let's see if we can set these up. And in the spirit of challenge, we're not going to change anything about him, so there will be no attraction between them whatsoever, but that's fine. Would you happen to be Myla? Yeah, you must be Duncan. This place is very fancy. Oh man, those compliments flying, blonde mustache man. What would you like? Something cold with no meat. Of course you're a vegetarian. Uh, cold with no meat. 
Beetroot, apple, and horseradish salad. Rodbet salad. Rodbet salad. There we go. Sounds delicious. Yes, it does. Uh, when out with a partner, would you keep hands off in public or make public displays of affection? Oh, of course you'd make public displays of affection. Yeah, we're the most affectionate person ever. Plus 30? Okay, just don't get a strike. Okay, we're good. We're good, but just be careful. Oh, uh, yeah, definitely make public displays of affection. Oh, good, Kitty, you came just in time. Make him happy with that answer, too. There we go. Okay, so that's, uh... Uh, it's avoided. We avoided that catastrophe. If you could choose a pet, would you rather have a fluffy bunny or a robocat? Well, she likes pet hamsters, so yeah, fluffy bunny. There we go. Oh, definitely a fluffy bunny. The old ways are indeed the best. Excuse me, I'm just going to the restroom for a moment. Okay, she has slightly green eyeliner. She's got the flower top with pink underneath, gold hoops, and uh, ginger pigtails. Okay, we can figure this out. We can figure this out. Oh, well, that, that's an obvious change. Did you change your clothes? I think you changed your clothes. Very nice. Okay. Yep, yep. Oh, just took off the jacket. Oh, okay. Wow, that's actually a realistic change. You look even more alluring than you did previously now that you've taken off that hippie garb. <laughs> you watch an awesome movie about street dance. Do you take a street dance lesson or buy it on DVD? Yeah, take a street dance lesson. That's the way to do it. Of course we'd take a street dance lesson. It is great to keep active. Yeah, at least they have something in common. Ah, here comes the award-winning chef. Thank you for the fine food. It was really good. Uh, we may, we would like to over-embellish. Of course we would. It had a dreamy, inspired aftertaste. It was beautifully and thoughtfully presented. Uh, it had an undeniable underbelly of fragrant mistiness. It had a pleasantly subtle overtone of wistful wondrousness. It was totally and completely satisfying. It had a hint of heavenly delightfulness, and it had an intensely intricate moistness. Ha! Nailed it! So good. Yes, we know our foodie jargon. Yeah, we should probably call it a night, then. Uh, I think we can definitely get this achievement right here. Breathtakingly stunning. Will you go out with me? Will you be my one and only? Yes. Ah, good. This should give us an achievement on the next screen. Right? Yep. Business, man. Pair off a chic and a hippie type. Ten extra coins for that. Always nice. And we're going to finish off this episode, as we always do, with some mail. Ooh, Olivier side bottom stayed together. How'd they do? Ah, Faith and I are still a couple and we've moved in together. Are you guys planning on kids by any chance? You love Faith so much that I can easily tolerate her predilection for modern dance. I did tell one or two white lies, but the end justifies the means. We're so in love and things just couldn't be rosier. We've sent you a gift to say thank you. All right. All right. Very nice. The happy couple have sent me. Ooh, stags for men. Thank you. And Cole Red Garden. Colt, Colt, Red Garden. Ah, oh, there we go. Lena and I are still together and we have a place of our own. Are you guys thinking about kids? We both really enjoy Harajuku style. We are so compatible that I can easily live with her obsession with tanks. Yeah, whatever. I did tell one or two white lies, but it was okay in the end. We're happy together. This could be for life. Nice. Now have kids, please. That's all the time we have for this episode. Not too many good couples were set up this time. I need I need some I need some luck flowing my way with that procedural generation. Anyways, I'm supposed to remind you to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Until next time on Kitty Powers Matchmaker, our quest for 25 children. Goodbye.